Today, we celebrate my mother. A strong woman that in the end of 50s, she met my father, which he was going to the University of Rome for science and politics. And my grandmother, she had a, like a whole flat and she was rent, near the university, she was renting the rooms to those uh, Somalis academies, future soldiers or politics, or, which my father was in there. So that's how they met. A strong woman since then, because my grandmother, she already decided one man for her. But she was in love with my father, so nothing to do. They got married and straight flight to Africa. And here we are. My father, General Police Chief of the Interpol, he had to stay in Somalia because he could not move at that time, so he was coming once in a while when it was possible. When we were in Italy, she had a little hairdresser, and she really struggled, but she never made us miss anything. She's also my mentor. I heritage how to design, I guess, because she has a very good taste, like where we're sitting now. Those rooms, she did it together with my brother. This garden. She's the one from who I learned it, how to cook. So I really have a lot to give to her back. And I'm glad I managed at the end. What we're gonna cook together is something that she teach me. She doesn't know. So I will surprise her after we cook. I will invite her to sit with me and to taste special cartoche. Let's see what she will say about it. I'm Samantha. I'm half Italian and half Somali. I have a place called Mediterranean on the coast of Tanzania. It's a little piece of paradise. complete with its own masai. Yeah? Okay, a couple of masai. I love food and I love to cook. And every week I love to share that love with you. Buon appetito. It's a hot, bustling morning in Dar es Salaam. I'm off to an early start. Kariako is the largest produce market. It has a long and interesting history. Today it spans several city blocks. And despite being slightly chaotic, it's a fantastic place to shop. For today's recipe, I'm going to need a variety of ingredients. Limes, tomatoes, potatoes, parsley, onions, and yellow and red pepper. Tomatoes, check. Onions, check. Lime, check. Potatoes, check. Una misania. check. You notice that I smell and taste everything, just to be sure of the quality. Produce at Cariaco comes from across Tanzania. It's fresh and affordable. Oh, sour, sour. This is okay. This is nice. So now, and actually, okay, I don't want to make angry nobody, but this is exactly the color of Rome and of my team Roma. So beautiful, more beautiful than this, nothing. I can hear some of you saying, Samantha, we didn't see you paying for anything. Don't worry, the production crew takes care of that behind the scenes. Me, I shop and cook. Ah, look what they have. 
Aloe vera. First time I see in the market like this actually. Very nice. Me normally, I take one big leaf, you no know, like this, and I blend and I make a juice. It's very perfect. I mean, for your stomach, for cleaning, it's for everything. It's really amazing. I'm surprised to try to see in the market. I have a van. Next stop, one of my favorite places in the Ferry Fish Market. Looking at its size, it's hard to believe that the fish market was initially known as the Beach Shed. It was established way back in 1970 by small fishing vendors. Today, the market operates every day from 6 a.m. to 6 p.m. I meet with my friends Jumanne. You will find him at ferry every day. We waste no time going straight down to the beach because... They just arrive with the fish. Yeah, you see, now they bring some fish. The women normally they do the buying. Yeah. Because huh? I saw also on the beach where I have the restaurant, yeah. they, when they catch with the net, yeah. there are many women waiting for the fish. Yeah, Shall we go and see the auction, how they do? Yeah. Here is the auction. Yeah, here is the auction. So the one just arrived now, where is it? Yeah, he moved the auction there. It's there. Let's yeah. go there. That man he is selling now from auction, so we have the competition. Yeah, 10, 12, 11, 13, depends. That one on tape, you know also. Yeah, tape, yeah, yeah. Anything we do nice in the yeah. south of it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Very good, very yeah, good. So cool. The auction have always fascinated me. You can get everything at Ferry Fish Market. And the prices are unbelievably reasonable. This is a small, small channel. Small, small channel. Yeah. These small fish are a firm favorite with women who sell along the side of the road. Still alive, huh? Eh? Yeah, still alive. Wow. I mean, it's been 7,500. 7,500 for the whole bunch? Yeah, for the whole bunch, yeah. Yes. We have the auction there for Sepia also. Yeah? So Let's go. Yes. It's easy to get distracted at Ferry. The fresh produce is so tempting. And just walking around the market itself, it's a treat I indulge myself once a week. A tiger ni meona gable, go Tiger, shao uzwa. Ah, o me shao uzwa, bas. Shao uzwa. Shao uzwa. Shao uzwa. Shao uzwa. Shao uzwa. Shao uzwa. But I'm here to pick up some fish for my Pesce al cartoccio. Subì, pole pole, pole pole. Ah, io samac. Eh. The Swahili word for fish is ah, samac. Look. Shark, eh? Jumainne shows me a couple of options. I'm looking very specifically for a nice, fresh grouper. But because it's fish, I just can't resist picking up one or two others, including a small shark. Today I only need this, and that one, shark and, and this one. And there is uh, one guy, he has those ones, I ask him three kilos. Yes. While the guy cleans the fish, we browse the rest of Ferry Market. Ah, now we go. Now we go. Lobster is my speciality. I know it back to front. Because of the live lobster export business I used to run with my brother. Remember, lobsters brought me to Tanzania. Yeah, because it just changed the skin. Yeah, it's changing the skin. It's like, it's like a... It's like a snake as well. Yeah, yeah. When they grow, when they grow, they need to, they come out, to, they do like this, and they come out for, with the tail from the back and the top outside. And this you can see is soft because the skin is new. It just changes. Different, Different than this one, this one which strong, is very yeah, strong. Yeah. So this when it grows, then it removes, and you say it's on the side, exactly the same, same, same. It looks like double, yeah. but it's only skin. Yeah, of course. <laughs> But I don't think so, this one is a good test if you the meat to already open the skin. Yeah, yes, the taste is the same. It's only the, the, the skin is, uh, is different. Okay. But on the other side, the big lobsters is beautiful for the show. But as a taste, the same one, 
five, six, seven hundred grams, much better taste than this one. And I think it's very this difficult to make grid this one because they already uh, soft. Yes. This one you can make grid because they're strong. Yes, 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 yes. But still, and sometimes you don't have a choice. <laughs> I'll see you. Time is moving and we have lots to do. Okay. I need to check Thank on the you. fish that I selected earlier. Oh, now we have our fish, huh? Yes. Very good, very good. Yes, the guy there is cleaning. Uh, very good. So, depending how you need, you want to clean it. You want to fill yeah. it No, pot. no, no, I just want to clean the tumbo and the skin on top. Oh, That's okay. it. This one, to remove all the skin. Oh, the shark. Yes. Some way that we cut up, and it goes yet. The ship's horn signals the end of my time at ferry. If you're ever in Dar es Salaam, the fish market is definitely well worth a visit. Time to get cooking. Now we're back on the fish market. Near the ferry boat goes to South Beach of Dar es Salaam, which we call Kigamboni. It, we, no, we call it calls Kigamboni and it's very beautiful, it has a very beautiful beach there, which we bought it our grouper. And uh, today we're gonna cook it, we call it al cartoccio, with, uh, with vegetables. The ingredients for our dish today are, this recipe is for two people. One whole fish, approximately one kilo, I'm using a grouper. Half an onion, one potato sliced, half a red and half a yellow sweet pepper. Two juicy tomatoes five small limes or one lemon, depending on what you have available at home. Salt and pepper to taste, 125 ml of white wine, and olive oil. So now, in uh, Cariaco Veggies Market, we bought it. Our tomatoes, our onions, potatoes, and sweet peppers. We're gonna make a marination with lemon, black pepper, and salt which simply we're gonna uh, I'll show you we're gonna cut our fish in few parts like this just to make the marination gets inside better and after that we're gonna soak the whole thing in white wine and we put in our uh, pizza oven. Today we use this, but you can use also your oven at home. Same, same. And then after that, I dedicate this dish to my mother, which is my mentor, and I would like her to taste it with me. Let's see what she's gonna say. It. And then before we put, uh, we prepare the marination for the fish, we cut our sweet pepper. I use half a red and half a yellow sweet pepper for this dish. The sweet pepper is a very particular taste. It uh, adds flavor to the dish, but also the onion, the potatoes, all together actually is a, is a good combination and very delicate. So when you eat, it, it has to melt all together in one taste, which what it will make all together, melt it together, is gonna be the white wine at the end. Okay, so now let's prepare it for the marination of this, uh, of this beautiful fish. We put lemon, which we squeezed it already. Actually, let's put it this on the side. A bit of black pepper. And a bit of salt. So we take our beautiful fish, which we already cut it so it can get nice and soaked in the marination. Then we take our aluminum foil. We set nice in here. And our fish, we just put it straight in here. 
This is a very simple dish. It's very quick to make it. We're gonna put our veggies simply on top and on the side. So let's take our sweet pepper. We put all over around. It's a very quick dish and very tasty dish. To the end, at the end we put some potatoes. Ah, it's gonna make a very nice garnish this one. We're gonna take again the marination. Then we put it on top, a little bit like this. We take our white wine, because don't forget, it has to soak the white wine. <laughs> to end with a little bit of olive oil. Now we can wrap it up. Especially also because in the pizza oven, the pizza oven is very, very hot. So being very hot, we don't want our fish to be burned on the skin on top. Now it's ready. Put it there, half an hour, then it's done. If you're using your home oven, set it at 108 degrees Celsius and allow the fish to cook for about 40 minutes. And now we wait. See you when it's ready. Let me remind you again of the ingredients for pesce al cartoccio. This dish is for two people. One whole fish, approximately one kilo, I'm using a grouper. Half an onion, one potato sliced, half a red and half a yellow sweet pepper. Two juicy tomatoes, five small limes or one lemon, depending on what you have available at home. Salt and pepper to taste, 125 ml of white wine and olive oil. The dish has been in the pizza oven for about half an hour and it's finally ready. Remember, if you're using your home oven, set it at 180 degrees Celsius and allow the fish to cook for about 40 minutes. Mm. Wow, smells so good. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Now we can serve. Let's go. Let's see what my mom she will think. Okay, mama. Ciao, Samantha. Oggi ti ho sorpreso. Today I try to surprise you. I dedicate this fish to you. Ti ho dedicato questo pesce. Grazie. Che è il filetto al cartoccio, il cartoccio fish which you teach to me. Okay. Now, let's see mm -hmm. what you think about it. Un po' di olio d'oliva, a bit of olive oil. A bit of fresh parsley. Okay, give me your plate. I make a little bit for me. Let's turn our fish.
and last a bit of sauce to give the everything. Now all this we're going to wet it up with a with a nice white wine from Familia Torres, Spanish, which is perfect with uh, with our fish, which it goes is a bit of Moscatel and Germondus and uh, grapes. Its back taste a bit crispy. And now let's eat. Mamma. Alla salute. Buon appetito. Grazie. Alla salute. Mmm. Nice. Buono. Grazie. Sono contento. Thanks to my mentor of my life and my mentor also of my cooking. See you to the next one. Ciao.